A lot of people really like that idea that if I eliminate kind of degrees of freedom, if I eliminate extra movement in my swing, that's gonna allow me to be more consistent. The problem with that is when I have this short area to accelerate in, I have to be really quick to get any kind of club head speed. So there, very fast in my swing. I felt like my hands were tighter. I felt like I was really having to muscle it to really get much distance out of that. So 108 mile per hour club head speed and uh, distance was 285. What happens if I smoothed out that short swing? So we went from 108 miles an hour. Let's see what I do if I'm smooth and I kind of hit that same position. Let's see what happens to the club head speed. Again, down the middle, a little to the right, but it's actually in the fairway. This is a doggly left hole. Club head speed went down to 90.4. Uh, total distance was 201.5. Okay, so if I'm making that short swing and I'm smooth, I just don't have time to accelerate the club. If I make that short swing and I want to hit it far, I really have to accelerate quickly. I get tight with my hands. I get jerky with my swing. It'll really be a grind to be consistent.